We turn now to breaking news. A Dearborn City employee caught in a lie about a racist Facebook post is off the job tonight. We broke the news with a push alert to your phone. On Monday, this man claimed someone else was responsible for degrading a Muslim model in a burkini. Now he's fessing up. 7 Action News reporter Simon Shaket with the fallout for us. Bill Larian is officially no longer employed with the city of Dearborn. This comes after he made a racist Facebook post and then denied it, claiming his account was hacked. He did not come from me. That's City of Dearborn Engineering Department worker Bill Larian telling a shameful, bold-faced lie to reporter Jen Schantz on Monday. After claiming his Facebook account got hacked, his attorney is now confirming Larian is behind a disgusting and racist post seen here referencing a Muslim American swimsuit model with the phrase, quote, cute picture should be on the cover of Camels Are Us. People are are offended by this post. Do you understand why? Yeah, they would I, don't, I don't blame them. Larian and his attorney have refused on camera interviews after apologizing publicly. But in part of a statement to 7 Action News, attorney Ed Zelenek says, quote, he felt bad that he hurt the community. It was ignorant. It was impetuous, impulsive, foolish, and irresponsible. He thinks that he has the ability to make such statements uh, working for government for the city of Dearborn. Founder of the Arab American Civil Rights League, attorney Nabia Yad says the outrageous and hurtful post late last week points to deeper bigoted feelings that offend the entire community. And the fact Larian tried to deceive us all only makes it more cowardly. Just adds insult to an injury and really tells a lot about this individual's character. And I think the city should really look at this individual very seriously because I think he's right now a liability to the city. Ayad has sent a letter to the mayor condemning this post. The Council on American Islamic Relations also called for swift action for the dehumanizing slur against all people of Arab ancestry. The mayor, who's publicly said he has zero tolerance for this violation of policy, is declining to talk on camera. And at this point, Dearborn's mayor has also stopped short of providing any more details about their internal investigation. From Dearborn, Simon Shaykhet, 7 Action News.